Hey guys, welcome back and here in this video, we are going to see how to get one plus 5T like face unlock on Xiaomi Mi 11, Lumax 2 or any other phone. First you need to set up smart lock on your phone. In order to do that, go to settings, security and lock screen and under device security, you can find an option called smart lock. Click on it, input the lock screen pattern, select the trusted face and follow the on-screen instructions to add your face. Suppose if you have added your face in low lighting conditions, you can improve the detection accuracy using improve the face matching feature under the trusted faces. Although the default smart lock feature detects your face within 1 or 2 seconds, the problem is you need to swipe up on the lock screen to get to the home screen. There are a couple of ways to directly get to the home screen avoiding the swipe up thing. Let's first try the unrooted version. For this, you need an app called Auto Input. The Play Store download link is in the description below. Although the app is free on Play Store, in order to use this app, you either have to pay minimal amount to unlock the full version or you can use the ads version which requests an ad click every day. Once you are done installing this app, go to accessibility settings on your phone, select auto input under download services and enable it. Go to auto input app again, click on auto dismiss key guard under standalone features and enable it. That's it. Now you can directly go to your home screen with face unlock. For the second method, you need root and exposed. Here I am using the Magix version 15.3. Once you install Magix and successfully rooted your phone, open Magix manager, click on hamburger menu, modules and click on the plus icon at the bottom of the screen. Now select the camera app like zip file and install it. This module is a must because with Magix installed, the camera app takes quite a bit of time to open. Next follow the same pattern, click on the plus icon and select the expose module and install. Next install the expose installer apk for Magix. All the download links are in the description below. Next reboot your phone for activating all the modules. Once the reboot is done, open the Expose Installer app and make sure that the Expose framework is correctly installed. If there's an issue with installation, click on Install or Update and select Install via Recovery. Next click on Hamburger menu, select Download, search for Instant Face Unlock and install the January 23rd build and select Activate and Reboot. You can also add a vibration feedback via Instant Face Unlock app. And as you can see, the face unlock works great. Finally, the third method. This is via well popular Gravity Box Expose module. The installation process is same as that of Instant Face Unlock module. Go to Download, search for Gravity Box Android Oreo version, go to Settings, select Beta, and install the January 31st build. Activate and reboot. Upon reboot, open Gravity Box module, select Lock Screen Tweaks and enable smart lock. As you can see, this works fine just like all other previous methods. The face unlock even works in low lighting conditions. All it matters is some light source on your face. It can be even the light from your phone screen. Coming to Lomax 2, I'm actually running on 8.1 AO SIP bell. The 8.1 ROMs are nearly stable but not completely. The auto input app works fine without root on Lomax 2 and also the instant face unlock module. But the gravity box module didn't work, maybe it is intended for Android 8.0.0 only. So let's just compare Xiaomi Mi A1 with OnePlus 5T with respect to face unlock. The Mi A1 took 1 second more to unlock which is really great because our phone was never intended to have this feature. But Lomax 2 took 2 seconds to unlock because of the 8.1 ROMs. It could be even faster with Nougat based ROMs. Do note that you need Nano G apps or higher versions for the face unlock to work. So that is it guys, I really hope you liked it. Hit the like button and subscribe if you did. Thanks for watching. See you soon in the next video.